Hello, Internet, and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. My name is Zanny, and I'll be your host for today. Before we begin, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Also, now that my Patreon is up and running, feel free to support me on Patreon. I've got several different tier lists, and ranging from $5 to $25 a month, each with their own unique benefits. That being said, let's get this started, shall we? Uh, let's see what this does. On it. Done. <laughs> that doesn't actually do anything. Interesting. And somehow we're frozen. Hang on. Okay. Sorry about that. The game is not going to let me go that way, so i got to go the long way around, because otherwise it won't trigger the right scene. On it. Done. That's not meant to do it. You're supposed to go this way. Hey, there we go. Oh, you coward. This isn't over, Malak. Your friends do not give up easily, Revan. You always could inspire loyalty. But even the three of you together cannot stand against my power. For the Jedi! I'll hold Malak off. You two get out of here. Find the Starforge. No, Bastila, he's too strong. No! <laughs> The door's sealed. We can't get past. Come on, we have to get to the Ebon Hawk. Oh boy. Uh, let's see. What about her? Bastila doesn't stand a chance against Malak, but we can't help her. Not here. We have to get off the ship and find the Star Forge. That's the key to beating the Dark Lord. Bastila sacrificed herself so we could get away. We can't let her sacrifice be in vain. Come on. All right, let's go. Uh, let's see. Dag nabbit. Hang on. That's weird. I don't know why I did that. Oh, here's the bridge. Oh, that's not the way I want to go. Yoon, here we are. And conveniently, we're able to go. You know Malik let us escape. Ah, uh, great. Incoming fighters! Gotcha! Where are you? Ooh, that's making me dizzy. Gotcha! Where is Bastila? What happened on that ship? We ran into Malak. He would have killed us, but Bastila sacrificed herself so we could get away. You mean she's... she's dead? Ah, Malak won't kill her. Don't be foolish. He'll want to use her battle meditation against the Republic. Turn her to the dark side, and the Sith will always be victorious. Hmm. We can't help Bastila unless we find the Starforge. Not so fast. We've got a bigger issue to deal with here. They deserve to know the truth about you. Do you want to tell them what Malak said, or should I?
Revan? What, what are you talking about? Is this some kind of a joke? No, it's no joke. The Jedi Council captured Revan and erased the Dark Lord's mind, programming in a new identity. Saul Karath told me on the Leviathan, and Bastila confirmed it. You're Darth Revan? This is... this is big. Do you... do you remember anything about being the Dark Lord? Um, not necessarily, just a little bit. Just a few flashes. That's it. Nothing more? Then I don't think there's a problem. It seems to me that if you don't really remember anything about being Revan, then it doesn't really matter anymore. You are who you are now, right? Of course it still matters. How do we know more memories won't come flooding back? How do we know Revan won't suddenly turn on us? The whole time we've been chasing after Malak, we've had his old Sith Master right at our side, listening to our secrets, hearing our plans. I don't see the Sith Lord standing here. I see a friend who's been with us through thick and thin. Remember, Malik's the one who tried to destroy Terrace. How can you say that, Mission? The Sith bombed my homeworld, Revan took away my family, and destroyed my life. Everyone knows it was Malik who gave the order to attack your people, Karth. You can't blame Revan for that. I suppose you've proven yourself to be a friend of the Republic by your actions so far, Revan. But can I trust you? Can any of us? You defeated the Mandalore clans in the war, Revan. You were the only one in the galaxy who could best us. We had never met one like you before, and never since. How can you even ask if I'll follow you? Whatever you're fighting, it will be worthy of my skill. I'm your man until the end, Revan. No matter how this plays out. What about you, Jolie? What about me? I already knew who you were, though it wasn't my place to tell you. Better off that you know, if you ask me. Does it change anything? I'm not here to judge you. You'll do what you have to do, and I'll help if I can. What about you, HK? Commentary. I am experiencing something unusual, Master. Such as? Answer. My programming is activating my deleted memory core. I believe I have a a homing system that is restoring it, Master. So this is the stimuli you were waiting for? Explanation. I believe so, Master. I was unaware of my homing system until it had been activated. It seems that the homing system deliberately restores my deleted memory core upon upon returning to my original master. You mean Revan? Affirmation. Correct, master. Sith protocols maintain that all droid knowledge be deleted before assassination missions and restored upon return. I have returned to you, and my full functionality is now under your personal command. It is a distinct pleasure to see you again, master. Observation. That does not matter, Master. I am your droid, regardless of your actions or personality. Wow. What are the chances of that happening? Remember, we're talking about the Force here. At this point, Malak himself could drop out of the sky and I wouldn't bat an eyelash. Good point. What about you? Well, the others seem to trust you. And I don't see any other way that we can stop the Sith. And I suppose that Malak is the real enemy here. I don't have any other choice, do I? I'm not gonna let you down, Karth. I want to believe you. You've proven yourself time and time again during our mission, but this is a little much for me to wrap my mind around. Ha! <laughs> how do you think I feel? This must be even more of a shock to you. I don't know how you even keep going. I guess we both just have to find a way to push forward. Don't worry. I won't let my personal feelings get in the way of my assignments or this mission. But don't forget, I've sworn an oath to defend the Republic. As long as this mission stays on course, I'll stick with you. But I won't let you betray the Republic under any circumstances. So I guess that's it then. We keep going. We've still got one more star map to uncover if we're gonna find that Starforge and save Basila, so 
Let's do it before it's too late. Okay. And here we are on back on good old Kashik. I deliberately saved this planet for last because the little computer where you find the star map reveals some rather amusing information. I want to talk to Karth, though. Yes, what's on your mind? Uh, no. You got it. I really hope I didn't screw things over with him. Oh. That's... Interesting. that rate, now I want to talk to Candace. Oops. I used to have this shit memorized. Oh, right. Moron. Yeah, what do you want? It has big trees. The Wookiees, I think they're more... We were wondering if we'd have to use larger weapons than our war droids if we wanted to clear the damn forest so we could fight in the open. You have anything else? Your choice. That's interesting. Hang on. That's interesting. I don't know why he's not talking. That being said, I'll take him with me. I'm gonna take you too. Because I want to talk to you. How can you possibly be a Raven? The one. The Jedi whose troops saved me on Taras. It was Raven leading an army out to defeat the Mandalorians. It was you. I knew when I heard that you had become the Dark Lord of the Sith that something was wrong with it. The woman who saved me, who I... I have come to care for, could never go completely to the dark side. It is good to know that you have truly changed. It gives me hope. I do not think now that I will fall to the dark side. I only have to look at you and follow by your example, and there is no way I can fail. I... I am sorry. I did not realize. I will never forget what you did for me. How may I be of assistance? What is it you... Of course. Alright, let's go back down. What's this? You kukumo no ba mulira. Ta kumju stak miki grabul mogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Ke puna! Bunanai tatu cinchi gratu loda bograshi on neon compa cin tondo mochuba loda dita kun ita fatisa batua kachatu tonga bograsha ronda di hotonga kun hanka 
Okay. Uh, Tag, this is Jupongo Cookie Macpaca. Ching Palachiska Mule, Tunaran. Kuyami Jus Chikata na Patoga ya, Fulki, Gokogala Jiji. Shagji Locha Wana Wama? Kava Volpa Mulji, Manaman Atota. Haki Jukrata Bola, Shui Chongatong. Chong Kino Bunka Mule Rakun Kile. Kunkile no ba tong hai tuam jiji jum lumpa nita poe tikito dolpa da bongwaleo gandona chu chut ka chi kun ita haldonga i king kuno ba mulera chi kun slimo chi gratu loda bograshi onion kumba chin tumba muchuba tong abu sha umnino Wonga Kumbi's King Balemura. Kabo Dumpa Ku Palia Mukapata. Punana Chaku. Ik Tolpa da Bongwale. Kanduna Gugu Chuk Chuk. Kabo Dumpa. Lovely. We tam tong abu sha. Tell you what, I'll meet you all back at the uh, horse field. Okay, sorry about that. That took a lot longer than I anticipated because, like an idiot, I forgot that I needed Jolie for this section. Interesting. These are the ones I was talking about earlier. In which case... Ah! 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 
To heck with it. I'll just do it on our We'll deal with that in a minute. I was gonna say, yeah, this is what I was expecting to find down here. Okay. another Terran to take. That's interesting. That might come in handy with Zalbar later. Because remember, he's still stuck down here. Almost 
feral after all this time. Calm yourself, Freya. We are friends. Don't you remember me? <laughs> Well, this may prove difficult. Ah! Oh. Oh, using bio band grenades? He follows because of a life debt. Tradition? Yee, that's an interesting tradition. Yikes. So when did you learn the truth? That's when I first saw him. I helped his pursuers lose him for a moment. Do you remember me now, Freya? We should be careful. Okay. Hang on, just a sec. Okay, sorry about that. Looks like we're actually gonna kill this episode here a little ahead of schedule. Because, long story short, I have choir practice at my church tonight. So, I'm gonna kill this one here. Cute. And I'm going to say thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Also, don't forget to try and support me on my Patreon if you can. Have a blessed day. Zanny Pator. Er, Zanny out.